All right, issues resolved. As it turned out, well, that was a friend of mine. Nine, if uh, you followed any of our Let's Plays before, we've, you've encountered him before. Say hello, Crobat. I am a spooky elevator voice. Ooh. Oh, God damn it. So, <laughs> now, mind you, now I'm curious about these. Seems like another elevator has lost its power. Huh. Well, to the left. Mm -hmm. And what we got here? Off. Okay. Really should have learned from the first one. And in we go, and... I think something... Something's going on. What's this? Why does it look like my... Heart? Yes? Kind of has a creepy face. Ah, it's a good number of amalgamate. Hey, it's just the top. And there's Alfie's. <laughs> I got you guys some food, okay? I'm not doing her voice very well. Sorry about that. They get kind of sassy when they don't get fed on time. I think they smelled the potato chips you had and... Ah, crap, I did have plenty of those. Please, potato chips. Oh, yeah. yeah Me mispronounce you'll it. You'll find out if you actually use the vending machine down there. They're potato chips. Yeah. I oh, went out. I've been trying. I didn't understand that somewhere in the game you can get a hold of ground beef. Huh. Uh, which is apparently made out of ground. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> of course. <laughs> oh, Alfie's, your reactions. I was just. Worried I would be too afraid and to tell the truth. Then I might run away or do something cowardly. Uh, I, I suppose I owe you an explanation. As you probably know, Escor asked me to study the nature of souls. During my research, I isolated a power I called determination. Yes, we know. <laughs> you injected it. Oh, we are. Yeah. Don't have enough physical matter to take. Oh, so that's what was going on. Started to melt. And... Did, did you recognize any of the amalgamates? Oh, yeah. Because some of them have very recognizable bits of other monsters in them still. Yes, I did. And I didn't say too much about it. Yeah, yeah, I kind of figured you couldn't tell him about that. You could have at least told Asgore, Alphys. Yeah, <sighs> but she was, you know... Alphys. ...out her position and everything. Hmm. But now, now I've changed my mind. Oh, yes, you should, and deal with the fallout. You need to do those things anyways if you want any shot with Undyne. Uh, screwing up's a natural part of things, trust me. <laughs> Remember, Undyne doesn't really care that much what you do as long as you do it as hard and well as possible. Yeah. Undyne don't care as long as you are doing it fiercely. Yep. Okay. And then a cow cave terrible puns ran through my head. Naturally. Alright. Entry number eight. 
Chosen a candidate. I haven't told Asgore yet, but I want to surprise him with it. In the center of his garden, there's something special. The first golden flower that grew before all the others. The flower from the outside world. Appeared mm -hmm. just before the queen left. I wonder... What happens when something without a soul gains the will to live? Oh, that is creepy as hell. 18, the flower's gone. Ring. The flower. It's a voice flower. you have never heard before. You know my name. You've done well. What do you mean? So, what? I, I made someone's plan work? What? And I'm going somewhere, whether I want to or not. Mm -hmm. Where? Wait. Wait, this is the palace. Yes, it is. And I think the steam broadcast just cut out on you. It did. Uh, hold on. Papyrus and Undyne. Oh, wait. It, it seems to be... Yeah. It's Zoom. Alright, let's try Toriel. She never picks up. I feel like there's something more I need to do. Okay. The last couple of entries that you saw... In Alphys's lab. Yeah. What did they say she was doing? She had chosen her sub... No, test subject, the flower. Mm -hmm. Flower. Confused with what? A will to live. Flowey. Do I have the right idea heading back already? It just... I don't know. Feels like I'm missing something. Well, I mean, there is the elevator that you'll, will take you most of the way just by you walking into it, but... Yeah. Well, I'm kind of tempted to do a little bit of grinding. I wouldn't record that naturally. Grinding what? Money. Grinding what, exactly? And what's in your inventory? Oh, I don't have... I don't have the thing I'm talking What's about. In your inventory? Well, I've still got my what, snowman stop. piece. St stop, stop, stop. What's in your inventory? Yeah, well... The snowman piece, hush puppy, two glam burger, the... And a bunch of pinko chips. You're fine. Yeah, then we got these things, and... Yeah, you know what? Let's switch out a glam burger for a legendary hero. Okay, so but, but still, this is no time to be chickening. All right. Well, so I'm looking for the flower then. Maybe. Did you load your save in order to do? Well, I'm after the after truth. You got up past the barrier, you loaded your save in order to. Oh, it dropped me off. Alphys. And you did that, right? Yep. Yeah, you just saw uh, me going That's to Alfie's. Oh, wait, I didn't trigger the rest. I feel. That's what it is. There's probably more with Alphys and Undyne, but how do I get that to happen? I was, was talking about. With yeah. You were supposed to go make friends with Alphys, and you did that. Yep. Alphys said, "Yeah, Flowey said Alphys would have it something for me." What? <laughs> the... Yes, it's called friendship. 
Okay, let's try this outcome. Still feel like... Ah, I have one to go get some... This is like the conversation that we had just a few minutes ago, Zeta. Uh, you kept trying to avoid. You kept trying to avoid the conclusion. Yeah, but I still With got there. Sentence, you got there, but it was very reluctant. Well, some of that was just for the display, and I know, I know the tone this game presents. Mm -hmm. And some of that was me playing into the tone of it. This is not something pleasant. But the tone is the, the tone is very important. Yeah. This is much an, uh, it's what makes make this more an experience. True. Just a game. Yeah, that's that's why I decided for uh well I will physically be at Comic Con, I will still be uploading things. That's right. I'm 500 miles away from my computer, and this has gone live. Wait. Why do I... Th yeah, okay, that brought me back there. Now that first part makes uh, sense. Do you notice anything? Do you notice anything different down there? Well, I'm still seeing the five coffins. As what far as I can... about these coffins? Uh, I don't really remember them from the last time. Might be a color difference. The time you visited, the one on the left was open. Oh. Now it's closed. Mm -hmm. All right. Also, I... Yeah, this path is different. Oh, wait, no. No, I was just being silly. This is where I wanted to go. Okay. Huh, now we're... Alright, save. Okay, this is going to be a longer one. Let's see what happens when I go through this door this time. I just feel like there's something more to do. Any thoughts? Or is it simply... Make your decisions. Make your decisions. Think about what you're doing. Ah, your heart. <laughs> ah, all right. I should know better than in this case to try and get a straight answer. It's like trying to get a straight answer from a cat outside of rub me. Even then, that can be ambiguous. Well, in for a penny, in for a pound. More than a yeah. Uh, all right. I was just trying to remember if I'd done everything to get the true ending. Possibly. Just feel like there was something more to trigger between Undyne and Alphys, but why not? Yes, yes, Asgore. It's time for this to happen. Again. Ah, oh, boy. Now I sort of wish I hadn't taken the long break I had. But, oh man, I love the music to this fight. 
Human, it was nice to meet you. Goodbye. Wait, that's... that's different. Woo! Toriel! What? What a miserable creature? Do not be afraid, my child. I... Yeah, I've been trying to call you! You never answered! Why didn't you answer? Zyda? Yeah. When has she said this before? At the very beginning, after you first encountered Flowey. Where Flowey almost mm -hmm. kills you! Mm hmm. Did, did that score almost? Uh, shatter mercy and try and kill me. Yeah, so... You'd have to take the life of another person. You'd have to defeat Asgore. Uh, yeah, alternate timeline. I did that. <laughs> yeah. Well, as far as this Let's Play is concerned, that was about two... I want to say two to three episodes ago. Mm -hmm. Alright, so for now, let us suspend this battle. As terrible as Asgore is, he deserves mercy too. He got mercy last time! Tori, you came back. Don't toy me, Dramir. <laughs> you pathetic whelp. <laughs> you really wanted to free our kind. You could have gone through the barrier after you got one soul. Taken six symbols from humans, then came back and freed everyone peacefully. But instead, you made everyone live in despair. No, she isn't. Because you would rather wait and here and... Yeah. Yeah. You're right. I am a miserable creature. But... Do you think we can at least be friends again? <sighs> no, Asgore. Yeah! Asgore! Human! Nobody fight each other. The fudge! <laughs> oh wow, I almost... That, that... Oh wow. Everyone's gonna make friends or else... Oh! Oh! Hello, I am Toriel. Are you the human's friend? You know, I almost dropped an F-bomb on a family-friendly channel. <laughs> oh. Hey, Asgore, is that your ex? And you see about that voice I used for her. Jeez, that's rough, buddy. You see why it winds up destroyed after 10, 15 minutes. Oh. Yeah, I do. Yeah, just a sore throat, thankfully. But, uh, yeah. Oh! There's two of them. Woo! Papyrus! If anyone fights anyone, then I'll be forced to ask Undyne for help. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Hey, human. Yep. Yeah. And Asgore shave and clone himself. Oh! Hey, guys. Sup? That voice! Hello, I think we may know each other. Oh, hey! I recognize your voice, too. I am Toriel. So nice to meet you. The name Science. And, uh, same. Oh, wait, then... This must be your brother, Papyrus. <laughs> Greetings, Papyrus. It is so nice to finally meet you. 
Your brother has told me so much about you. Wowie! I can't believe Asgore's clone would know who I am! Oh. This uh. is the best day of my life! <laughs> I sank their wow. battleships. And their whales! I don't... You prompted no. that. <laughs> In yeah. What does this skeleton tile? Hmm. No proof roof tiles? No, silly. A skeleton tiles his roof with shingles. I changed my mind. This is the worst day of my life. Nice. Come on, Asgore. It's gonna be okay. There are plenty of fish in the sea. Yeah, Asgore. Undyne's totally right about that fish thing. Sometimes you've just got to, uh, stop going after furry boss monsters and, uh, just get to know a real cute fish? About time you said it! It's a metaphor. Well, I think it's a good analogy. Oh my god! <laughs> the audience is dying for some romantic action! Hey, shut up! Man, the nerve of that guy! Right, Alphys? Uh, uh, Alphys? No, he's right. Let's do it! Uh... Well, uh, I guess, uh, if you want to, then... Don't hold anything back! Oh, oh, the awkwardness! Oh, wait! Not in front of the human! Uh, right, sorry, I got a little carried away there. Did you notice Yeah... <laughs> Ah, uh, yeah, I think staying here for a while since. Okay, this is becoming its own episode. I'm not joining it to the previous one. Right? <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Wow. Okay. Pa Papyrus, you called everyone here, right? Well, besides, uh, her. Uh, anyway, if I got here before you, how did you know to call everyone? Let's just say... Well, I suppose you could say... A little flower told me. I love how silent it's gotten. A tiny... Flower? Oh... Crap basket. You idiots! Oh, you guys were having your little... Wow! I took the human souls! And now, not only are those under my power, but all of your red souls are mine too! <laughs> I have so much fun doing Flowey's voice, just, yeah, you know, getting to jump all around. It's all your fault. It's all because you made them love you! All that time you spent listening to them, encouraging them, caring about them, Without that, they wouldn't have to come here. And now, with their souls and the humans together, I will achieve my real form. <laughs> huh? Why am I still doing this? Don't you get it? This is all just a game. Oh, wow. If you leave the underground satisfied, you'll win the game. And if you win, you won't want to play with me anymore. And what would I do then? But this game is between us. We'll never end. Oh, I buck that. I'll hold victory in front of you just within your reach and then tear it away from you first before you grasp it over and over. Oh, God damn it! We're not doing this again. Listen, if you do defeat me, I'll give you your happy ending. I'll bring your friends back. I'll destroy the barrier. Everyone will finally be satisfied. But that... Oh, boy. I will beat you, Flowey. What? That... Even if it means killing you a million times. 
Hey. I can't move. I can't do anything. I can't do it, Captain. I do it have the power. Something. Uh, uh oh. Yeah. Uh oh. Sweet dreams having a hiccup. Yeah, oh boy. Do not be afraid, my child. No matter what happens, we'll always be there to protect you. Huh. That's right, human. You can win. Just do what I would do. Believe in you! Hey, human! If you got past me, you can do anything! So don't worry, we're with you all the way! Huh, you haven't beaten this guy yet? Come on, this weirdo's got nothing on ya. Ha. Huh. Technically, it's impossible for you to beat him, but somehow I know you can do it. Human. For the future of the humans and the monsters, you have to stay determined. I like this. Holy crap! All! All the people! Yeah? No! Unbelievable! Inconceivable! This can't be happening! You! You! You were f mucking with me. All of your souls are mine. Holy crap! So I think the entire monster race just got slammed into one little flower. And that flower is this kid. Let's. Okay. This kid? Well, we haven't been introduced. Properly. Who is this kid? <laughs> uh, I know the name. I don't know if the game's actually told me the name. Oh, Wait. You get it. Well, I know. So, Rose, are you there? It it's me, be. your best friend. Now. Azriel Dremer, the child. Dremer. Whoa, that was an interesting bip check. Infinite, infinite legendary being made of every soul in the underground. Oh. It's the... Oh, wow, that... Dream! <laughs> Think about why you're here. You feel the empty space in your inventory getting smaller and smaller. What empty space? Holy crap! <laughs> uh, that's happening! <laughs> uh, chips. Oh, I know. I don't care about destroying this world anymore. Whoa! Yeah! Yeah! Uh, understand, Crowbat. When stuff's going on, I can't hear you. <laughs> Try defeating gang cuddle. Oh, I know I can! <laughs> Where'd your... Oh, that looks bad. Oh. No! Yeah. Well, that's the name of this... Okay. Bring it on. No! Zit! Damn it. Wait. Wait! But it refused. Whoa. 
Okay. That was kind of nice. Okay, I misread that attack horribly. And I think my buddy duck, ducked out. That or I'm not hearing him very well. No, I'm still here. Wait, last dream? Last dream, last dream. Through determination, the dream comes true. Oh! Okay, watch the side he's on. Well, the dream would be the freedom of the monsters. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, I got... Ooh, Blazing Star, I don't know that one. Dream came true, your health. And we can do everything all over again. Maybe. Oh, this attack. Okay, I can deal with this. I can deal with this. Holy crap. Oh, crap a duck. Yep. You know what the best part is? You'll do it. Whoa. Oh, okay. Oh, no. No touchy. Whoo. I almost made a mistake there. Yeah. Oh, wow, this is... Okay, oh! Right, I want to be under... him. Middle. Drop. There we go. Let's go to Dreamer. Hope for reduced damage. And again. Ah. It's all right. Woo! Hush, puppy. And again. Whoa! Galactica. Dream came true, and because you want a happy ending. At least a little. Ah, it's worth the struggle. Chaos Slicer? Chips. Because you love your friends. Oh! Ah! Misread that. Here. Drop over. Clear. Dream. Adam's filled with dreams. Because you never give up. That's what I did wrong. I was moving too fast. Whoa! That was nuts. And isn't that delicious? Your determination. The power that let you get this far. It's gonna be your downfall. Don't let them scare you off. Yeah. Well. It's yeah. not just about hunting. Yeah. It's about what you want. Why you want it. Why you want it. <laughs> yeah. Ha. <sighs> Gotta love that little thing called determination. Wow, I might actually need to do something I've never done in this LP. 
and break things in break an episode in half because we are fast coming up on now it's already at the 35 minute mark for this recording at 45 I hypergoner hope and reduce damage it's time to purge this timeline once and for all uh... okay no not going in there Good. yep you remind me also slightly of uh, Sans. Oh boy. And. Whoa. Azrael blocks the way. Wait. Okay, so I'm not supposed to have... Hold my true power. Okay. Oh, hell no. Thank you. Wow. And this file... <laughs> this is getting massive fast. Your grip on this world slips away. Every time you die, your friends forget you a little more. Life will end here. No one remembers you. So all I can... Oh, I'm not. Things are not going... Attitude will serve you well in the next life. Yeah. Dang it, I'm off. Being off beat. I'm not giving up. Come on. Struggle. Nothing happened. You tried to reach. Nothing happened. Wow. But, maybe with a l little power you have, you can save something else. Oh, what wow! What can you save? From the look of it, my friends! Why can you save your friends? Because of the bonds. In the depths of Azrael's soul, there's something resonating. The lost souls appeared. Something about this is so familiar to her. Okay. Ooh. All right. Soul that you won't hurt him no matter what. Something about this is so familiar to me. Okay. This is gonna be a fun little challenge. Not yet. A lost soul that something is stirring within her. Oh, we are doing this. Huh. Woo! Two. Mm-hmm. 
Papyrus and Sands. Ha, ah, this is gonna. Remember what they are. Yep. Remember what they like and what you. <laughs> well, you asked the last soul to cook something for you, trying to hide its joy. Whoa! Mm -hmm. Oh, wait. Don't. Oh, wow. Oop. Yeah. Puzzle. Doesn't know why, but he really wants to help you. Oh, don't. Don't. Go. Don't. Yep. 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 Ha ha! You. Joke. Suddenly the memories are flooding back. Now I'm rooting for you, kid. Undyne and Alphys. Alright. Ah, Undyne. Clash. It's familiar somehow. Fake it. You're a real enemy. Oh, come on! The actual fight was harder! <laughs> Undyne does like a good smile. Alphys. Yep. Undyne is all about passion. <laughs> like Alphys is all about nerding out a lady after my own heart. And again, that's why I married my wife. <laughs> no! Do you understand? about a challenge. No. It's about reminding you how you got here. Who yeah. <laughs> True. Why they're your friends now. They really are. Quiz. Goofy. <laughs> True. Yeah. Do you really... <laughs> oh, I know that there's something more. I don't have to fight. What is it? What is it you want to save? Oh... <laughs> you reach out and call their name. That would be you, Azriel. Azriel and the child. Remember when you first fought Azriel? The, the previous farm? Yeah. How the attacks were all the same, but they kept changing names? Uh, yeah, like a kid would. Uh huh. And that last one was called Hyper Gun. Yep. Who are you really fighting right now? Ah, uh, that's pretty much. What huh. kind of person is this, Zito? This, this is someone lost. You know what? Remember what we talked about before I joined you for the recording? Yeah. Right now, I'm letting the game talk about it. I know. He's just full. Yeah. 
He's lashing out. He doesn't know what to do. Anger's simple. Yep. I understand very well, actually. <sighs> Been there plenty of times in my it's life. Really anger, though, no. Not really mad. Nope. It's just a <laughs> yeah, you're the only one who has fun to play with anymore. I am going to save you. Because that's what friends do. Friends are there for each other. Yep. That's right. And actually, during our conversation, there was one thing we, we actually left off. There are three things that can really drive people to extremes. Deep depression, hatred, and love. That's right. They're pretty good. Yeah. I'm not gonna stop doing this. I'm not gonna stop you either, Israel. I'm just gonna save you. Bring it. You need a hug, Ezreal. You're alone for a lot of reasons, buddy. And I'm not stopping or giving up on you. And fear's good. Fear mean, can mean a lot of things, which does include change, and guess what? We're talking about a big change. <sighs> wow, and this is officially... Uh, this is going to be the longest video ever for this series. It's cool, Ezreal. Can I hug you already? Little bit. No. Ah, <sighs> time to betray some of my knowledge. Yeah, Zoros has been gone a long time. The name I gave to my character is the name of the first child who fell, whose soul you possessed. Yep. I was playing as Frisk. Frisk. I haven't felt like this for a long time. Yeah, you were kind of soulless as a flower. I lacked the power to love other people. Oh boy, howdy. You tried to kill me. You did kill me a few times, too. And I can feel every other monsters as well. Wow. They really do care about each other a lot, too. Yeah. Uh. I mean... They're people. Hmm. Yep. Your mom. Monsters are weird, even though they barely know you. Feels like they all really love you. I put effort toward that. Ah. I heard so many people. Friends, family, bystanders. Wow. Nope. No, oh, there's only one answer. Let's be honest. Well, of course. Oh, no, crying is very good. First, something I have to do. 
Right now, I can feel everyone's hearts beating as one. They're all burning with the same desire. With everyone's power and determination, it's time for monsters to finally go free. This was the plan. <laughs> this was the plan that the first kid and Azrael hatched. Was it? Possibly. That's my thought, at least. It is or isn't, we'll see. Yeah, you do have to go, Ezreal. Yeah. It's nice to meet you, though. No, I'm not going to forget about you. Comfort. Thank you. You needed that. You really did. I don't imagine you would want to let go. Yep. <sighs> it's time. Well... Flowey still was showing, like, some signs of compassion. Huh. Alright, and that is that. Yeah. Hmm? Is it the end? We're getting there. Are you sure everything to do has been done? Uh, part of me feels like there's something more. Mm -hmm. you know what? Not quite there. There's some choices to make yet. What? Uh, you broke up right- You should probably break up this video as soon as you have control. Okay. Yeah, I kinda figured. Huh. You made Papyrus cry like a baby. Ha! <laughs> I just got something in my head. Yeah. Yes, it was tears. Yep, tears. Yeah, here, Frisk. Why not drink some tea? It'll make you feel better. There. How about we give them some space first? Yeah. It's a flower, and then everything went white. Yep. Uh, before then, she might want to take a walk. Say goodbye to all of your wonderful friends. Okay, and I'm back in control. Alright, yeah. yeah. Time to wrap this sucker. Video this video... Last yeah. Yeah, the next one will be the last one. So... Alright. This is Zyda Rose. I'll see you guys next time for the... Yep.
We'll see you guys next time for the conclusion of Undertale. Late.